Hey, it's me, Javine. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play God of War Ragnarok. Completely blind, uh, we are going through Alfheim. We are trying to find the light of Alfheim. Oh my god. Uh, we did this back here, right? Big thank you to everybody that supports me and what I do. Supports Cindy and what she does. Supports both of us in any way, shape, or form. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think we need to go down here. We need to jump over here. We need to jump over here. Oh, we can go up there, though. Interesting. Hmm. What is the optional zone? I'm betting we need to go... Oh, we can do that. Interesting. Okay, what does this do? That's the wrong... Oh, I see. Another test. He's getting the hang of it. Okay, really, I've like... Seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. Yes, that's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Spartal Yoffer's counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Yes, he's in the light now, too. Okay, what do we do here? Uh, let's go left. So that moves that. The question is why are we moving that? I don't know. Uh, what also does this do? Okay, this lets us go up here. Oddly enough, what chest are we looking for? So we're looking for that chest, I guess, which will give us either a rune or a piece of equipment. But to do that, we need to break through one of the lights. So let's head back over here. And then let's see, how do we we can we can we can't even toss our axe though, so we have to move this one way or the other and then throw our axe. But the question is where? We move it to the right. Oh, I see. Okay. It's a lot easier than I would have thought. Alright, draw the axe back. Move it to the right. Excellent. Yeah, you got it, Tyr. You're picking it up when, you, when I'm putting it down. Okay, what do we got in this chest? Let's see. Rune engraved release accessory. A simple trinket signifying rebirth? Accessory? Okay, so we can just, like, equip... That's just literally an accessory. That's just literally an accessory? Don't even know what that's for. Seems a little anticlimactic after all of that. I'm gonna be this real, though. doesn't see us. There's twilight stone on the ground. The mystic doesn't see us, and there's Twilight Stone on the ground. Oh, I see. I get it. I wonder if we could use Twilight Stone against them. Reflect Axe throws off Twilight Stone to stagger enemies. Interesting that there's, like, some sort of stealth mechanic now. Not really true stealth, but, you know. How the heck do I activate this thing? Is it, like, this and this and this and this? Is it R1? Is it L1? L1 and circle. Okay, there it is. L1 and circle. Climb, my boy. Climb. Here they come. Do what you must. Let's do it. Let's go grab that real quick. It's gonna be so wonderful when we can actually fight and don't have to be grinding out skills. Oh, come on, that's so accurate. Are you serious? Okay, let's do one of these. Light Elf Mystic. Getting in close gives you the upper hand against their weak forward defense. So if you can't help closing the gap by, say, tripping them with a well-placed axe. Oh. 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 T, you're gonna need you to move out of the way, big guy, please. I still Damn. can't figure out how they're making light bridges. Look at this statue. 
Got crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. Look at what statue? The statue here? Crystals, I've noticed them on the elves. If this statue were to fall over the chasm. Yeah, give me a second, big guy. Got to, uh... Got to check and see if there's anything about that we can grab. Hold on. Doesn't look like it. Surprising. You would think yeah, that maybe look, one of these would bounce. The foundation's weak. Father could push this over, no problem. Yeah, I know, guys. Hold on. Just give me a second. <gasps> seen what we can and cannot interact with. Alright, fine. Let me push the statue. Well, that works oh. swimmingly. Crystals don't make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? To Harry Pottery! Okay, hold on. I saw something out of the corner of my eye. Look up. See? Feels even taller on the inside. Can't believe all this was down here. Okay, looks like that's everything up until this point. Got some clouds that are inaccessible. I've got a route down this way. Where does this go? We've we been here already. I don't think so. Interesting. We're probably gonna have to use. Hmm, but where's the other stuff? Our Nornir chest? Just a norm here. Normal chest. Okay. I feel like these bots act like uh, Zelda pots. Where if you need health, they'll give you health, basically. Mm, this is weird. Why is there a random Nornir pot thing here? That is odd. Because we haven't spotted the actual Nornir chest, right? Huh. And I don't want to miss it. Okay, let's keep moving forward. Maybe we'll see it. Oh, there's more here. Oh, there it is. Okay. So we've got R. We've got... So then we'll have to throw that and hit that. And then we got to locate the final one. It's the final one. <gasps> Okay, does anybody see the final? Could do one of these, but if it's not glowing blue, that means it's not hitting anything we care about. Are there enemies up ahead? It sounds like there is. Reflect axe throws off twilight stones to stagger enemies. And Ow. here we go. Ow. Labor complete frost rush, thankfully, because that one was a long one. Skill labor, Leviathan's Fury. Using combat at grease tier while sprinting, press R2 to perform a massive leaping attack, applying frost. Oh my god. Okay, come on. These guys are like perfectly setting up their attacks. Damn it. One of those light bombs! Careful! Okay, gotta find some health crystals. Find you! Incoming! Oh no! Oh. oh god! Oh no! Got a health burst at least. I see a crow over there. Let's get him. There we go. Gosh dang it. They keep sight hitting me. No! Oh, I saw that coming too. Come on, Atreus. You can do it, buddy. Okay. Maybe you can't do it. 
Oh, the heavy attacks take so long. Okay, I can see a health crystal over here. Jeez Louise! Light up on the left! Okay, one more hit and we are gone. No! Oh my god. Focus here, it's a bit scary. Okay, bronze tier complete. Oh, come on, you're gonna go halfway across the map. Get the heck out of here, dude. Watch your left! Does Tear just literally run around doing nothing? I don't know why my brain just forgot how to throw the axe. That was disgusting. Yeah, I really don't like the lock-on being just taken away. It feels so bizarre when that happens. This is the last. No! Oh my god. Dang it! Come on, Atreus. Now would be a great time to grab onto him. No! This is a fight, man. Oh, that attack. Locks onto you from so far away. Okay, that was a huge fight to have to redo. I'll see you once it's done. Okay, looks like we're about to finish it here. That might be it. There we go. Yeah, that was a rough. Yeah, that was rough. The axe, the heavy attacks are so slow that fighting these guys that are like super quick makes that really difficult. Okay. Okay, gotta get the crow again. Let's not forget him. Or the raven. Keep calling them crows. The raven. And then there was something back here that we wanted to do. The Nordir chest. Usually all three are close to the chest. So the question is, where is the last one that we didn't see? There. Okay. So we go bop. Bop. And then bop. Aha! You better than us, Bubba. I can't remember the last time I visited the Nords, nor do I wish to try. The maximum rage has been increased. Collected enough horns of blood mead. Maximum rage increased. Heck yeah. Okay, moving right along. Let's see, we got all of these little reflection <laughs> sort of things, but those are supposed to be used during combat. Unfortunately, I'm far too obsessed with progression. <laughs> In order to actually use them. Um, looks like they want us to go up there, but there was a light bridge over here. But I guess that was just allow to allow the elves to go through. So moving right along. Excuse me. Okay, what do we have through door number five? Door. Number five. Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. That angle isn't gonna work. Do you think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? Had Freyr not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now... Can we really place all the blame on Freyr? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? Right. His choice. The wrong one. For Alfine, perhaps. But not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own paths, regardless of where they end. Right. 
Okay, let's see. So, looks like we have a couple of paths here. Or maybe just one. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. You have to jump over. I feel like there was another path, though. Maybe not. Let's head this way. <clears throat> can drop this. Feels very satisfying. We got a little old chest hanging out back here. Hack silver plus 228. Okay, now what does that do? It might reveal a chest down here. Looks like we're trying to reveal, yeah, one of these. I'm not sure where we're trying to hit. We're trying to hit that crystal there. Does this guy have one of those things? No, but this one does. There must be a way to move this statue's twilight stone to get the right angle. Right. Yes, I understand. You know, I was going to mention this in the last episode, but, like, the character's constantly talking about stuff. It would make sense that they would be saying that, were you on the same team, obviously. Okay, how about you? Do, do you work? I feel like we maybe could finagle that, but maybe not. Let's head back down. Okay, can we hit this off to hit that? Hmm. Not seeing any blues, regardless of which path we orient it. I'm not really sure what we're supposed to be doing. No blue lines. Let's see if there's anything back over here real quick. Okay, the question is, can we move this even further to the right or to the left? can only move it left or right. So it's got to be this one, I'm assuming. Might just have to go to a specific spot to hit it. Yeah, that looks a little bit better. Hmm. Perhaps we're supposed to go and look at this from the other side. Like my original thought over here. But yeah, we can't even see it, though. It's so weird. Okay, I'm at a bit of a loss here, actually. I don't understand what they want me to do. Um, let's walk through it step by step. So, clearly... They want me to hit that crystal right there. The only reflective material is this. And obviously, it's got to be this, because why else would we need to move it? question is how the heck do we throw this and have it hit that from either angle that's what I'm not understanding unless there's something else we're supposed to be hitting with this in which case that would make a lot more sense however I'm not seeing anything hmm. I really don't know I'm kind of confused we might have to cut here Let me try one more thing before we do The only thing I could think of is maybe... Oh, maybe we're supposed to... Oh, am I super dumb? Are you just supposed to jump back over this way? Throw it from here, maybe. I don't know. It really does not give us a good viewpoint, though. Yeah, we can't even see it. Hmm. What the heck? It's very confusing to me that there's two sides to this. You would think that the one side, it would just have one side, so you would know which, um, which side you're supposed to be hitting. Okay, uh, oh wait, what the heck is that? Oh, did not see that. Okay. That changes things completely. Um, how the heck am I supposed to hit the other one, though? Like, from here? 
I wonder how tightly this game is designed to, like... I wonder if you can finagle hitting it, considering how big the hitbox is. Okay, so that broke off one of the wings. We have to break off the other wing, but it's trapped. I don't like when it's blue. Showing that it'll do something, it doesn't actually right. do it. Okay, there we go. I did not see those little... Those little circles whatsoever. Okay, then we can do one of these. Tear. Hopefully. The last time we were here, we killed the Dark Elf King. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Sparky. We had to defend ourselves. But when he died, he told us he helped the wrong side. I see. There we go. <laughs> It all has become clear. This way. Thank you so much. Okay, that one really stuck me for a while. Let's go. Do you still hear something wounded out there? I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. There, the central chamber will bring us to the top once we find our way past yet another light door. Damn, assuming we got a boss fight coming up. Oh, we gotta get through this light door. I see, I see. The question is, where's the crystal? There's the crystal. Well, where is our reflective material? There's one. There's some soundstone up there. It pairs quite nicely with the Twilight Stone. A knack for interior people like elves. Ah. It's facing the wrong way. Facing the wrong way. A. Eh? Hmm. Maybe if we allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Ah, oh, the light of Alfheim. I could hear mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When father went inside the light, he you said You went he... inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... Difficult, to say the least. Father, she's... she's gone. Yes. He 
moving. And that'll be a good Almost place there. to end for today, ladies and gentlemen, right before something major happens, I'm sure. At an emotional high, low. Thank you so much for watching. Big thank you to everybody that supports me and what I do. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.